Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. As we start a brand new week, one of the things we have to be aware of, not only we can set it in motion by our attitude, we have to take a look at our fears. One of the tune-ups last week I talked about fear. Fear seems to be a topic that concerns a lot of people a lot of times, yet a lot of people never want to admit they're actually afraid of things. So today I want you to think about your fear. What are you afraid of? Many people are afraid of success. Many people are afraid of actually allowing success to be one of those things that happens in their life because of added responsibility. Maybe they're not good enough. Maybe what other people will think of them. I hear this all the time, that there's a belief sometimes when we are successful that successful people are bad. So inherently in you, there might be an attitude deep within yourself or a belief that says, if I'm really successful, my friends won't like me anymore. Successful people are mean, which has never been farther from the truth. Success means you're taking care of yourself. Success puts you in a position where you're not part of the problem, you're part of the solution. When people are successful, not only financially, but morally and spiritually, they rise above the mediocrity of everyday life and become leaders. Leaders in their community, leaders in their family, leaders in their own sense of taking one foot ahead of the other and going in a direction that creates not only progress, but creates an action of resolve. So today I want you to think about what are you afraid of? And is it real? And if it is, do something about it. Start working on it. Maybe talk to a coach like myself. If it's not real and it's just something you heard from someone else, start really breaking that down by creating resources within yourself by watching other people who are successful who are actually good people. You see, a lot of times these things hold us back. We're completely unaware that they do. And once they hold us back, it creates an ongoing pattern. The first of this week, Let's make this a successful week. Let's make this the first week to make this the most successful life you can possibly have. And you can do it. It's an attitude of deciding to and not believing what everybody else says. Believe what you tell yourself. In fact, your subconscious mind believes everything you say, not what other people say. Until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary successful day. And let's have a great week. Bye-bye.